It's well known these days that the original cancel to Fallout 3, Van Buren, had many of his concepts put into Fallout New Vegas. Among those were Joshua Graham. In a lot of ways, he was very much like his original interpretation. A missionary from New Canaan who became the right hand of Caesar, and was burned alive and thrown into the Grand Canyon after his failure to take Hoover Dam. But this is where things start to diverge. Originally, he was known as the Hangman due to the player finding him being hung on a pole. If cut down, he would join the player as a companion. Statistically, he was the best companion you could have. However, he was also very hated by tribes and even civilized society feared him, making it hard for players with poor negotiating skills to advance peacefully while using him. The Hangman was far less repentant of his actions than the Burn Man. He was notably described as evil having personally committed many atrocities. He would butcher any twin mother's tribals he found and would laugh at a salvager who demanded the player's party put away their weapons when entering the small community of Burnham Springs. A way to think of it, the Burnman was an element of righteous vengeance, while the Hangman was an element of malevolent chaos. 